chorus, but the crowd screaming. Hey guys, this is Craig Yaws here for EAN TVZ and uh, I hope everyone's having a nice day and uh, let's do a quick video on the new YouTube layout which I'm not really liking that much but there are still some good features and there are some bad features so at the moment um, if you're using Google Chrome and you go onto the YouTube homepage you will see a, a, com a completely new layout so as you can see it's more stretched out so you have the, the YouTube logo which is way further to the left and then you have your, your profile um, all the way to the right and then then so you can go into your that's, that's your channel settings and this is your Google uh, account settings and then obviously down here we have all the videos and updates from your subscriptions and then you have your recommended channels here um, so also it um, all the sort of channels which it thinks you might want to subscribe to with the videos been watching so here you have your your tabs which you used to get just in random places on the old YouTube and now they're organized on the left um, I don't really particularly like this as I liked it as the way before which was sort of cleaner and more I found it more user friendly than this and I'll get into more detail now later so this is so uh, this is your account settings which I've kind of signed into your channel settings and that shows all you've done so all your likes and stuff and then you have your watch later and stuff right here recommended social so I'm kind of connected to Twitter and that's it um, so yeah and then we have your recommended so this is the, uh, the videos that it thinks that I want to be watching for my uh, subscription and then also we have this down here we have my subscriptions so this is uh, all the videos from my subscriptions which is basically the same as the home page maybe a bit different and then we can, then you can search all the uh, subscription lists I want to search for EN TV zone that will come up like that now we also have a list of all the channels which are, you are subscribed to so it makes it quite easy right there you can't pin it that's the thing so you can't pin channels anymore that is coming a big list and then we, if you want to go on to browse channels so this is all the channels which um, features so here's my recommends for you which you saw on the light on the on the light so on, on the right sorry and then uh, all different categories which you can find so um, if we go back here, you can see this button down here, manage subscription. So this is all the channels which you are subscribed to. So as you can see, if I want to, I can unsubscribe. I can, with this tab here, I can, like, you can have emails with all the new updates. And then tick on this one, it will only show the uploads. So if you don't want to see what they've liked, then uh, you just click this button here. And... Um, it will just show their, up, their upload. So um, that's basically it. And um, so this is basically the main part. So wait, the uh, the actual channels haven't changed. So if I just want to go on to EA and TVZ, okay. And then I actually go onto it. So the actual channel hasn't changed at all. It's uh, it's all the same stuff. Um, to be honest, I'm not really liking this new view. Um, I'll show you in a minute exactly how you can get rid of it if you really want to do something big. But um, so basically, uh, it's all kind of stretched out. It doesn't seem as user friendly. And as you can see, you have big white gaps down the right and the left, which used to be filled with recommendation and adverts and stuff. And maybe you didn't want the adverts, but it filled in that space, so it made it feel much more than it already did and uh, they, they kind of hit they kind of hidden it away but if you if you want to just see um, only show uploads from this person then you basically got to do that which isn't the greatest and uh, you got to go onto every single user then and press it which if you have you know 59 subscriptions like me you don't want to be doing it for every single user so um, you know it's not exactly that great but there is one way which you can get rid of this 
so um, basically if you have Internet Explorer which should be built into any Windows PC um, then you go onto YouTube this is the old YouTube again now you're probably wondering why aren't I using this on Google Chrome well on Google Chrome as you can see I have all my bars and stuff and I have a handy feature with the Google Mail Checker and what I usually do is I might usually just leave Facebook on or something and uh, leave that to run uh, so I can get any messages straight through and uh, if I'm downloading anything else I'll just leave Chrome on so I don't really ever close Chrome to I just leave it on Facebook or something then I have all my extensions as well which I don't want to lose if I go on to Internet Explorer you know I can use this but you know I'm not going to have all my features which I did up here so um, as you can see this you know this is the old one so I have my pinned subscriptions on the left and then my recommended on the right and then um, I have my channel manager right there this is one thing which I miss in the new layout I don't have my manager right here so I can see my inbox and stuff so um, yeah uh, the new layout I'm not really liking that much to be honest I hope they change it back to the old one because uh, you know a lot I know quite a few people which aren't really happy with this so um, yeah guys this, uh, thanks for watching this quick video what I think about um, the new YouTube layout um, if you like this video please click the like button and smash that subscribe button and I'm signing out adios